Hey everybody, thanks for coming out. Uh, last week I got news that the first poem I'm going to read was accepted into a literary journal that's located in Yorkshire, England, and I'm like so thrilled that my words are going worldwide. <laughs> yeah, thank you, yeah, thank you very much. It's, it's um, a little journal called um, The Algebra of Owls, and it's located in Yorkshire, England, and it's going to be in the November um, issue, so I'll look on Facebook when it comes out, I'll let you know. It's called, It Lives in the Basement. Loneliness crept up the stairs, stood in a corner, observed the situation, searched for the easiest to infiltrate, curled around her unknown. Smoke unseen, loneliness holds her tight. She thinks its warmth is comforting. Quickly she's left, abandoned, alone, trying to make snow angels at midnight. Thank you very much, you're very kind. What's the other hand? Read with the other hand. The paper, what's <laughs> I always film terribly at these things, and I'm left-handed, so I hold my hand like this, and He's, to face the camera, I have to be right-handed, so if I screw up, it's because he's making me be right-handed. <laughs> <laughs> this is called For Frank. River? Oh, For Frank. River flows, carries life through the city. Sailboats, freighters, ferries, like blood flows giving you life. Reminds me of the glimmer once in your eyes. Rowing crew works in unison. Gently moving as one, upstream. For you, Frank, your body's rhythm has come undone. Victim of chemo or nicotine. Night draws near, as does your last breath. The burning glow on the horizon calls to you. The heavens welcome you home. Thank you, thank you, thank you. This is called Incubus. I remember under the stone arch, Rustic garden gates, opening them too close to your consciousness. Your lyrics are in my brain, create the song that I begin to live. A chor your chorus becomes a hangman's noose. Is it a dream or sacred ground? Changes are unexpected, pleasurable. I fall to earth. And my last poem is called before I met Star Black. I've always thought that poetry was the abstract art of literature. I've seen so many forms before, all different, so obscure. I'm not a scholar. To me, it was abstract, no rules. I have seen so many forms and now I know. I can't Jackson Pollock my words on the page just because there was a rhythm. You have to write sentences. I can't let my words morph Matisse-like into creation. You have to use punctuation. I've learned poetry has rules, unless you break the form. Sistinas, guzzles, villanelles, and sonnets, pantoum, terzeriza, haikus, and ballads, all these poetic forms have rules. There's nothing abstract about it. Thank you very much.